I'm Joanna Small, J-O-A-N-N-A, S-M-A-L-L, -L, Public Information Officer for the Commerce City Police Department. And then what are you able to tell me? Right um, we're at 72nd and Highway 85, just after 4 o'clock. We received a call here for an active shooter, so essentially the entire Commerce City Police Department, assisted by Adams County, came here. Um, when we arrived, we determined that there was just one victim, um, and there was uh, a customer, an argument that ensued between a customer and an employee. The employee was shot and was transported to Children's Hospital as a teenager. We believe the customer got into the vehicle that he arrived in. It was being driven by someone else. The person driving that vehicle pulled over a short while later and called 911. And at that point, it appears that the customer exited the vehicle and fled on foot. We know who that individual is. We've had dealings with that person before. So we're not ready to put out an image. We're using law enforcement resources to try to locate him at this time. So it happened inside the store? Well, we, we're not entirely sure whether it happened inside the store first and then moved outside, but there's evidence outside as well. So we're trying to review video and kind of see how it all transpired. Um, I, I should say that initial reports were unclear whether or not the employee was also armed, and we've now determined that he was. So there were two people firing back at each other during this argument. And were there a lot of people in there? Not know? sure if there were a lot of people. There was at least one other employee. There were people in the drive through There were some individuals in the parking lot. It's a pretty small business, so I don't know if there were a lot of other customers inside. Okay. That's all we need. Okay, perfect. Are good? Yeah.